Hello, this is Ammons Gaming Network, and today is the 18th of August, which means it is the release day for Microsoft Flight Simulator. So today I'm going to be taking you through the installation process. So as you can currently see on my screen, um, the installation has just finished, so I'm now going to click on continue, and I'll go through it with you. Right, so as you can see, now it has loaded. Um, so, choose your graphics settings. So, for the minute, I'm going to put it on high end. So I'll click on next. Services, we will have satellite data streaming, which is recommended for the best experience. And also, this is depending on what your internet can handle. So, a faster internet speed, if possible. So, 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 so about data cap, if you have a data constraint you can limit your data speed and consumption now or later in the general options menu. Here it's unlimited and there's no constraints whatsoever so we'll just click on next. So it's detected the following controls. So it's um, managed to pick up my Logitech flat yolk system so I will, well it seems to have apply the default control scheme. Eventually I will go in and customise each button on what I want it to do. So, in fact, now I'll just quickly click, click on customise and, and have a look at the yoke. Nice. Yep, so that seems okay for, for the minute. So, Middle ground, so it's got piloting, aircraft systems, failing damage, navigation aids, notification, and user experience. Obviously, go and change these to what you want to change them to. Take off auto wood. I will turn that off. Is this the checklist? I'll leave that on and see what it's like. Aircraft system auto mixture, I will turn that off. I'll leave gyro drift auto calibration on failure and damage. Crash damage enabled, aircraft stress damage enabled. Engine stress damage disabled, right, okay. Icing effect, visual only, well. Right, so root waypoint off, taxi ribbon. Um, right. So I'm just gonna go and click next here and I'm going to apply and save and we've got a nice little Cessna Skyhawk there I'm very excited about this and here we go we are now on the main menu of the Microsoft Flight Simulator and in the next video I'm going to look at flight planning on the new Microsoft Flight Simulator so I hope you enjoyed this video Please give it a big thumbs up, like and subscribe and I will see you all in the next video. Thank you for watching.